Welcome to the BYU Family History Library. This video provides instructions for using the Shotbox Portable Light Studio. Before explaining the details of the process of using the Shotbox Portable Light Studio, here are some general instructions about the equipment at the BYU Family History Library. The BYU Family History Library has a very useful collection of electronic equipment for scanning and digitizing books, documents, photographs, photographic slides, 8mm and Super 8mm movie film, VHS cassettes, 8mm video cassettes, audio cassettes, reel-to-reel -reel tape recordings, and Betamax tapes. Information about the hours of operation and availability of the scanning and digitizing equipment at the BYU Family History Library is available on the BYU Family History Library website. All this equipment is available for use by patrons of the library free of charge during the time the library is open. However, it is best to contact the library through its website and click on the link to the Scanning Equipment page to check equipment availability. If you have a BYU login, you can then use this page to reserve a time to use the equipment. If you do not have a BYU login, then you can see the times available for using the equipment and contact the Family History Library help desk to make a reservation. Please be aware that much of what you find online is protected by copyright law. You are responsible for determining if any specific records are covered by some country's laws. Becoming aware of the copyright restrictions that apply to the records you are interested in digitizing is an important part of being a responsible researcher. A light studio is a space specifically designed for photography where you can control the lighting conditions to achieve the desired effect on your subjects. The shot box is a small portable light studio that helps you scan documents and take photographs of small objects. The shot box has built-in lighting and a mount for a smartphone camera. To begin, you will need your own camera or smartphone. You may also need a tripod or other device for stabilizing your camera or smartphone. Make sure that your camera or smartphone has enough image storage capacity for the images you are interested in making. The shot box comes with a variety of backgrounds that can help to highlight your images. The process of making shot box images is very simple. You set up the shot box. You turn on the light or use the flash from your camera. You can put the item or document you wish to photograph in the shot box and make sure the image is in focus and then take an image just as you would using in any other method. Always review the images to make sure that the lighting is adjusted to the proper level and that the images are in focus. You can take photos from the stand that fits in the front of the shot box or from the top looking down on the document or object. To some extent, the quality and resolution of the images will depend on the camera you're using. We thank you for your interest in using the equipment at the BYU Family History Library and hope that you will take advantage of the opportunity provided to preserve your ancestral heritage. Keep learning and thanks for watching.